minus two last night. Where is my straps here? This got relieved off the tractor. I'm gonna move in three loads of honeybee colonies. Should, well, I'll get these three in for sure and hopefully another six yards this afternoon, if not nine yards. Let's push a little bit. But I think I'm heading back out to the field after lunch. So that will end my day moving bees. I'm not gonna get all the colonies in before it snows. They're forecasting a foot of snow now. But I can move bees in the snow. I've done it before. We can't work land in the snow. So we have to keep priority on the field work at hand. And we're just about done. This last field would be the our last one, first time over, except for the section of corn we haven't combined yet. <clears throat> and then we have another quarter section of corn that we need to do a second time. So that's likely what we'll be doing this afternoon. Get that done. And that'll likely end it for land work. Things are going pretty well. Other than I only have six loads of, of yards in, or six yards in, two loads of these. Oh my goodness, I just dread the fact of moving bees in the snow. It just happened so fast. Mother Nature turns on a dime. Here's some of those Ray Oliveira's Saskatchewan queens. These boxes are full of bees. One, two, three, four, five, six dead spots in this yard. So I'm not claiming too much success. But what I have here Pretty darn good. And one of the problems with these bottom boards, bit of a chore. This will be yard 16. And it brings me to roughly half my colonies once I sort them inside. Half my colonies indoors. And hopefully I can get another 10 yards in tomorrow before the bulk of the snow comes. 
because by the end of Friday they're talking over a foot. So we'll see how much falls as snow and how much falls as rain. Holy smokes, these colonies are ah, full of bees. Sorting in boxes, like every yard I'll have about three or four I have to shift. And I'm not complaining, but it's hard shifting boxes of bees like this. Nice part is they're fairly docile. I guess that's what five pounds of protein does pounded to them before September. Building bees. It's like baking a cake. You get the bees, you need some sugar, you need some protein, you need some pollen, you need a little bit of supplement. Well, I'll unload this truck and then go jump on the tractor for a few hours. Thank you. 